we'll see what he does here against Carlson. One, two, jammed him. Slow roller to Carlson for out number two and a collision at first base. Umpire calls Morrell out as Stokely has to go into the base path to field the throw from Carlson and he collides with Morrell. You better check on Morrell because I'm going to tell you, Stokely's a thick kid. When I was watching him in batting practice yesterday, well built the momentum, kind of takes him there and they go down. Anytime you got a pitcher making the throw in the field, the accuracy ah, comes out of the way a little bit. North Carolina fortunate that he was able to hold on to that ball. Stokely's a big boy too over there. I, I told you he was thick. <laughs> That's what I put in my scout report, thick, so I was thinking you better check on Morrell, but Stokely, kind of the sitting target there with a base runner coming full speed down the first baseline. Both of them will get checked out. Stokely gets a visit from the trainer, but two ground ball outs here early for Carlson, Jay. Challenging him with the fastball, but really just trying to see if Hofstra's going to be able to catch up to is he? He does a good job. It's not just a straight fastball. It goes inside, it goes outside, it goes downward. Off to a good start there, throwing a number of strikes, going right after these hitters. And you mentioned throwing fastballs. This North Carolina rotation loves to throw fastballs. This was a story you got while you were at the field yesterday about Brandon Schaefer in a game earlier this year against Virginia Tech. What did he do, Jay, on the mound? He threw, out of 102 pitches, he threw 99 fastballs. He only threw three balls that weren't fastballs. And I was talking with their pitching coach, impressive pitching coach Brian Gaines, about that. And he said, seriously, he threw one in the first inning, he threw one in the ninth inning to end the game on a strikeout, and only one more in between. So they believe in power pitching, and I really like the way they do it, because anytime you talk about pitching, everything's predicated off the fastball, but with them, they've got four seamers, they throw two seamers, they go inside, they go outside, and we've seen Carlson right now really keep the hitters guessing where is that fastball coming. It's not like you can just get the batter's box and tee it up and take it for a ride. Hunter Stokely is okay after the collision with Brian Morrell. Good to see. Nice work up from the training staff there. The sophomore stays in the game. And so it'll be two outs for 